Welcome to the studio here at African Utility Week in PowerGen Africa, where we're talking about the topic of microgrids. Gentlemen, Aaron, Ricardo, welcome to the studio. Aaron, mini grids are the hottest topic in Africa. Why? I think what we're seeing right now is uh, the recognition that people don't really understand rural Africans as customers. We've got Coca-Cola and Unilever out there and Vodafone, MTN, but that's about it. We see that on the one hand as a huge problem, but the microgrid sector is really seeing that as a huge opportunity as well. You know, that's 600 million customers that are waiting to be tapped. And uh, just this last 12 months, we've seen the World Bank put the first billion US dollars into this sector in one country alone, which is Nigeria. And we see that as the opening of the floodgates to, to the space. Ricardo, talk to us about how disruptive technologies are changing business models. Thank you, Ross. So the point is that Mini grids are a way to deliver development into rural communities. People need much more than power. They need water. They need access to finance. Data is the key behind that. Today's technology allows us to remotely monitor and collect data of people in the middle of nowhere and bring them a plethora of services to suit their needs. Now, our focus is not just on electrons. It's on the, what these electrons do for people. And today's technology allows us to have remote demand response systems where we can size utilities in a way that many things are being done in a cost-effective manner. Okay. So what does this mean for Africa in the next five to ten years, Aaron? We're going to see a lot of regulatory reform and policy reform. Um, industry associations like ours are going to be working together with companies, with financiers, with governments to help pave the way for this utility 2.0 that we're going to see emerging. And we really do see the beginnings of commercial capital coming in. Ricardo's company is already partnering with one of the big multinationals in this front, so we're really starting to see that change already. Absolutely. It's a huge opportunity. We're talking in the tune of $100 billion for Africa alone, maybe more. Strategics are interested, as Aaron said. I happen to sit on the board of a national utility in Uganda, that's Umeme. And if I put on my Umeme hat for a second, I can tell you that national utilities today are looking to private developers for solutions and for technology. And there's a lot to be said in the partnership that this will bring. And it's just an exciting time to be in mini-grids in Africa today, Ross. I'm excited. Thanks for joining us on the studio. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for more industry-related content. Thanks.